Okay, I come back from my leak, and I still have nothing. <sighs> there are two only powers are absent. I feel like I have to work with the last bit of evidence she gave me. You have to find something? Yes, I know, Maya. I will, I will, I will. I promise, Maya. I promise. I have to work with the last bit of evidence she gave me. I knew that Hammered was injured and couldn't do any action scene, so I left them behind. <sighs> He's dragging his leg. Mm hmm. Guide map. Um. Well, I have to use evidence, and I have to use this. Deductive reasoning. Spear. No. I don't think a map is gonna work. These don't work. This could work. Clock? I knew that hammer was injured and couldn't do any action scenes, so I left them behind. These don't work. No. This is all I got. Dragging leg. There is no way. You knew that Hammered was injured? Do you think that's a little funny? I mean, it was Steel Samurai who was injured. It was Will Powers. What? Mr. Wright explained to himself. Yes, Mr. Hammer is dragging his leg in this photo. But that's because he was pretending to be Mr. Powers. But pretending? One person was injured in the run through that morning. That person was Mr. Powers, and not Mr. Hammer. <laughs> That's delayed. Now, why do you think it was Mr. Hammer who was injured? Oh. Now I see what- Okay, let's get him, Phoenix. Uh, I already said, it was Sal who told me. That That's right. He must have gotten it wrong. I think not, because Sal was there. Mr. Manel was at the run through that morning. He would have known it was Mr. Powers who was injured. He saw it happen. Why would he tell you the wrong person? Exactly! Miss Vasquez, you saw Hammer limping. There's no freaking way. Actually, you didn't hear anything from Manella. You saw Hammer limping with your own eyes! Yes, but. Is it Mr. Powers who was injured? Yes, but remember. Paper time, baby! So Hammer was dragging his leg too. Uh huh. He was pretending to be Mr. Powers. Hmm. Ah. And when was he doing this? Well, it would have to have been after he put on the Steel Samurai suit. And he went for it to Studio 2 when he was murdered. Exactly. Miss Vasquez? You met him, didn't you? You saw the Steel Samurai limping. And Mr. Hammer was in the Steel Samurai suit. That's why you were confused. That's why you thought it was Mr. Hammer who had been injured that morning. Hmm. Order, order, I will have order. Witness, can you refute this claim? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's see who sneak out of this one. But she's got something. I know she does. Very well. I have a question for you. Uh, why the real killer is always so persistent? Why in the world would I want Mr. Hammer dead? Yes, he'd fallen on a hard time, but he was a star. I had nothing to gain from his death, and nothing. Mm, yes, you would need a motive. Why would she have killed the victim? Is there a reason it is unclear to this court? The defense of anything to say on the matter. In other words, can you prove she had a motive?
Hmm. 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 Okay. Let's run through it again. Process of elimination. What would be her motive? It's turning bad. Absolutely. No. The autopsy report doesn't help me, just as it was pierced. I, that's not gonna get me there. Motive? It's limping. I don't see how that actually helps me at all. This is the floor plan. What type of motive is a map gonna give me? The spear? Broken. That's not a motive. Unless she throws some, like, freaking thing to the spear. This, I don't understand why the motive would be a clock. So, no. These are Cody's. Absolutely not. This makes sense. Can we still don't know who this guy is. And if we also look at the photo, the reaction on her face kind of says, that says some stuff. That, that, that says some stuff if I'm being honest with you. Aight. Aight. Sleeping pills. Motive. I don't understand what that would have to do with her? So, no. Plate? No. Man? No. I think I got it. Of course I can prove it. Okay. I have proof and I'll show it to you. I presented the court evidence as to Miss Vaqua's motive in the murder. This is my proof. This is... This is the photo from before. This photo reveals the motive in this murder. I'm right, aren't I, Miss Vaqua? Miss Vasquez? And, mm. Five years ago, Mr. Hammer was at the height of his fame. The D. Vasquez helped a terrible accident swept under the carpet. Ladies and gentlemen, the case is currently up for trial. It began that day five years ago. Mm. Ironically enough, the accident precipitated Mr. Hammer's fall. His fall from stardom. His guilt weighed him down, no doubt. However, you, D. Vasquez, use Mr. Hammer. You made him work for you for petty change. Bring us to the present day in Mr. Hammer's last role as the evil magistrate. Yes, undoubtedly it is a constant um, source of shame for the X-Star. Hmm. Wait a moment, Mr. Wright. We're not talking about motives here yet. You have only talked about Mr. Hammer. It almost seems as if, as if it was Mr. Hammer who had killed D. Vasquez, not the other way. What? What motive Ms. Vasquez have? <laughs> yes, that's right. According- oh, I forget the judge now is playing prosecutor. That's- no. According to what you say, I would have had no reason to kill Hammer. He was a good source of income for me. I never give abuse for men. It's a policy of mine. It's right! You explain Ms. Vasquez's motive for murder. Well, if I can figure out who the guy is, because that guy's got to be important. There's no reason she would have that look on her face. Okay. Please explain. She had no motive. Well, no, you need a motive to kill somebody. So who's the guy in the photo? If I can figure that out, I got her. Please explain Miss Vaquez's motive for murder. I think. Okay, again, process of elimination. The attorney bad. No. All right. The autopsy. No. Photo. Of this. No. The map. No. Spear. No. Clock. No. These cannot be motives for murder, unless I bring this up. Well, no, he's a good source of thing that wouldn't make any sense. Okay, I have two options then. This is my last ditch option. The path to glory. Money. But also, I feel like it could be kind of like a thing of like, you know, Jack took someone important from her and I feel like that's why she would want to kill. I'm still feeling this. I don't feel like sleeping pills, this doesn't work and this doesn't work. Okay. Allow me to run to the court. Evidence pretty much that his motive. This is my proof. 
And this tells us why Ms. Vasquez wanted to kill Mr. Hammer. I say all it proves that the defense attorney has completely lost his marbles. Uh, no. That's right! Court requests that you find your marbles immediately. I'm afraid I had to penalize you for this waste of time. Nick, we're so close. Bring this one through, please. It's right, I'll ask you again. Please bring this for murder for murder. Well, I have to reveal evidence. Obviously. Okay, allow me to present to the court evidence. Well, if it's not that, then it's gotta be the book. I want to throw my process of elimination. It's gotta be the freaking book. This is my proof. And this tells us why I'd say it's all the proof that the boss is marbles. Do I have to give up and say I have no proof? What? Okay, let's think this through. Let's think this through. Let's think this through. Let's think this through again. Reason for murder. I only have stake and motive for murder. I don't know. Um. Uh. -huh. Oh, the trucker. Please explain Ms. Vaquez's motive for murder. I'm so close. I don't... I legit don't see a reason. I think the suit and tie is done, guys. Oh, no. Because they start, the, the badge means nothing. Okay, the autopsy, what the heck is that going to give me? Okay, nothing. This, powers this photo. I don't see how this gets me anywhere. Not a clue. Mm. Striking one leg, I don't make any sense. The map doesn't give me anything. The spirit doesn't give me anything. The clock. No, this doesn't give me anything, this doesn't give me anything, this doesn't give me anything. The van? I don't know. I don't want to say she had no motive though, that just feels like I'm giving up. What if it's like a big brain play? She had no motive, your honor. Was that no? It was Mr. Hammer who was out for blood. All Miss back was to was push him off the stairs. In self-defense. What's that now? It's simple. Mr. Hammer was intending to kill Miss Vasquez? What? What? Because he wanted out. You're on it. Jack Hammer drugged Mr. Powers with sleeping pills. Jack Hammer snuck into the dressing room and stole the Steel Samurai's costume. Jack Hammer wore the costume to fool the secretary lady and thinking he was Powers. And Jack Hammer made his way to the trailer. And for what purpose, you ask? To kill the backwest who had so cruelly taken advantage of him after all those years. I did it! She broke the pipe. So, you did do it, didn't you? Hmm. Yes, I am guilty. It was me. Someone call an ambulance. Th there's blood everywhere. We're too late. Ah, Miss Vasquez, what what happened here? Manuel fell from the trailer stairs. Manuel, Manuel, Miss Vasquez, please try to remain calm. No, no, oh goodness, it was an accident. 
Mr. Hammer was doing an action scene then. No, Manuel, Manuel! Don't touch him! Don't don't touch him, Miss Vasquez. No! Please, please don't die. Please. Congratulations, Mr. Wright. I lose again. Mr. Edgeworth, where is D. Vasquez? In the waiting lobby, Your Honor. As calm and collected as ever. I see. Mr. Wright! Uh, uh, yes, Your Honor. If you see boy about yet another miracle, I thank you, Your Honor. I think not, Your Honor. Your powers was innocent. That he should be found so is only natural, not a miracle. Yes, yes, you're right. Hey, well, this court finds the defendant, Mr. Will Powers. Not guilty. Bro. That's so insane to me. That is so insane to me, though. It was an accident that she did that? Whoa, dog, that case is wild. That's an insane case. Bro, if I did not big brain that at the end, I think still, my big brain at the end there was nutty. Okay, case 4, case 5, I gotta step it up. I'm not messing up case 4 or case 5. I gotta step, my, I gotta step up my game. But that still to me is insane, dude. The flubs. I big brained her for a majority of it, though. I did big brain her until the end. Until the end, I got got. I got in the end. And that was it. I said that's pretty good. She was hard, dude. She was insanely hard. Oh my god. She I liked her as, as a villain, I thought she was nice. But the ending's kind of accidental again? That's ironic. This is all wizard. Oh my. October 20th, 1.12 p.m. District Court Defendant Lobby Numero 3. I need also words from Edgeworth, though. I, I don't know what to say. Thank you so much. I'm just glad you're okay. Yeah, but it's sad. I don't know that Mr. Hammer stole my costume. It's bad enough that he wanted to kill Miss Vasquez, but think that he tried to frame me for the murder. Makes me sad. Tell me why, Mr. Wright. Huh? Tell me. Why did Mr. Hammer want to blame me? How's your star, dude? Show some evidence? Well, this is what I think. Mr. Hammer want to put the blame on you because... It's because you were the Steel Samurai. Because I was the Steel Samurai. Yeah, Mr. Hammer was a big star once, but he was reduced to acting in a kid's show and as the villain to boot. The kids loved the Steel Samurai, and so he hated you. I, I think I understand. He could have just told me. I would have changed places with him any time. I think you're missing the point here, bud. Uh, thank you. I'm really glad it's all over. So am I. So am I. Congratulations, WP. I thought you were gonna me. Oh. <laughs> Thanks to you, I'll be I'll be able to don the Steel Samurai outfit once more. I can't wait to get back into that sweaty costume. And... Oop. Is something wrong? No, no, no. Of course not. Ah! Nick Edgeworth. Yeah, talk to me. What's going on in there, dog? You can't know my defense. What's going on? Same. Say something, right? I'm not good at small talk. Huh? What? Um, that was... that was too bad. Edgeworth. You don't waste any time gloating, do you? No, I really want to thank you. Vasquez would have gotten away if you hadn't stepped in. Uh, pleased to meet you. I'm, I'm Powers. Uh, or Edgeworth. I'm a big fan of your work, Mr. Powers. A liar. Right. I must say, I hadn't expected to meet you again after all these years. Meet again? However, in retrospect, it would have been better had we not met. Thanks to you, I am saddled with unnecessary feelings. Unnecessary feelings? Yes, uneasy and uncertainty. Aren't those kind of necessary? 
The only stuff to get in my way. Listen to me, Phoenix Wright. Don't ever show your face in front of me. What? That's what I came here to tell you. Uh, uh, Mr. Wright? What, was that guy your friend? What? Friends? As if. They were rivals, rivals, right, Nick? For now, we are, I guess. Huh? Why do I get the feeling I'm missing something? Come on, Nick, tell me! Let's deal with you in Edgeworth. And so the curtain closed on another trial. I caused quite a stir by revealing that accident from five years ago. It was the talk of the town. Thankfully, Global Studios rethought his programming change. They went back to making kids shows again. Oh god. Oh no. Nick! This is it! The new show starts today! You're gonna watch with me, right? I'll admit, I was kind of surprised. I didn't think they'd seriously go through with it. Get to my train cards too, okay? We have to trade with Cody and that assistant. Fine, fine, I'll do it. Isn't it great that WP gets to play the lead again? I wonder if they'll show his real face this time. I don't know about that one. I don't think the world is ready for the real willpowers. A pink princess. The end. Holy lord, what a time. What the? Wait, huh? A brand new episode has been added. Oh, a parrot. Edgeworth looks like he's going through it right now. Oh, juvenile lock. Turn about samurai. The episode has been added. Ah. Okay. Save that mother trucking game. Yeah. Okay. Oh my turnabout goodbyes. Dog, I gotta upload this Phoenix Ride stuff. Quick dog, I wanna play more. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed case three, I think I big brained it for the majority of the case. I have my flubs. Case four, I'm not flubbing. I'm telling you right now I'm not gonna flub once. The process of elimination stuff really helps. Okay? I'm not flubbing once. Alright? Alright, cool. Anyways, I'm gonna head up out. Thank y'all for watching. My throat is dead. That's that was like what? I don't even know how many hours that was. Oh god. Almost like six, I think. Oh god. Anyways, I'm gonna head up out. I'm tired. I gotta take up the suit and tie. You know, I, I like fresh, but like. I just realized I took a mob boss. That's hype. Anyways, I'll catch y'all. It's time. Bye bye.